After eating a hole in the ice in the opening scene, Scrat, the saber-toothed squirrel, climbs a glacier and hilariously zips away while spitting out buckets of water. The world of ice and snow is gradually thawing, but the Ice Age creatures are unaware of this as they continue to have fun in the pools and slides that have been created by the melting ice. Our three main characters from the first movie, Manfred, Sid, and Diego, are among them and are also taking advantage of the weather. As a result of the amusement, Sid establishes a day camp for kids, but neither the younger animals nor his sarcastic buddies Manny and Diego take him seriously. The valley's resident con man, Fast Tony, a six-banded armadillo, makes the dire predictions that the earth will flood and that the bark and reeds, which he sells, are essential for survival. As a result, two youngsters flee in terror. Manfred rejects the notion, but is soon sidetracked when he witnesses Sid attempting a high dive from a massive waterfall. Manny and Diego learn that the warm weather forced the inner layers of the valley's massive, bowl-shaped glacier to melt as they climb to the top of the waterfall to save Sid from his act of daredevilry. The valley didn't flood until the glacier's outermost layers, which created a dam, were removed. With his sarcastic songs, Sid constantly irritated Manny about being the last mammoth left alive, even though he wasn't really attempting to make Manny feel down, he was just being Sid. Despite his initial determination that he was not the final mammoth, Manny finally gave down and allowed the realization to set in. To his delighted relief, Manny encounters Ellie, a female mammoth, while out on a solitary, soul-searching trek. Ellie thought she was an opossum like her brothers Crash and Eddie, but he quickly learned that she was a very weird creature. Ellie makes it clear to Manny that he is the one she wants to spend the rest of her life with, but when Manny makes an unsuccessful effort to convey his love, she quickly departs with the mammoth herd. Despite this, Manny soon pursues her with Diego and Sid's help, and, while dangling from a tree like an opossum, confesses to Ellie that he doesn't want to be with her because they have to, but rather because he wants to. While Crash and Eddie joyfully cry together, the two lock trunks and hug as the onlooker mammoths trumpet in honor of their new romance.